not uh, definitely not great. I would like to definitely get out of here with a little bit more gold if possible. We are up to 30 points though, so we could probably spend some on uh, some upgrades there. Um, so we'll max out this. Max out this. And... Yeah, I'll do something like that, I guess. I'll do Yo, 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 everybody, what's going on? It's Lodi's here, back with another Nordic Ashes run. Hopefully, y'all have been enjoying the content. If so, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. And if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Every little bit helps. I do really appreciate it, as we are working our way towards a 1,000 subscribers. But you guys already know, we are playing Axel Door today. We'll see how this goes. We are going to run the Iron Hammer. Um, and that's that's the plan. And we're on Spartel time, running Expert Mode. So this should be a, this should be a pretty good one. We'll see how this goes, though. Well, without further ado, let's jump right out on this. Hopefully we can get some uh, good progress. We need to run... We need to head directly toward... Yeah, this guy. So luckily we started this out right off the bat. Um, the plan is to... The plan is to get area and, I think, cooldown. More projectiles, of course. Um... That'll work. And then, yeah, we could go Shockwave, but I'm going to go Burning Trail. Yeah, baby. Here we go. This should be interesting. <clears throat> and also, if we can get a ton of of uh, two blue hearts, this, this is kind of a waste, but I mean, it's, it's free hearts, so why not? All we need to do is make it to... All we need to do is make it to um, the next Ascension Crystal and we'll be fine. Um, let's go projectiles. Okay. We're doing okay. I mean, two blue hearts would definitely help us out quite a bit. Right now, <clears throat> we got 17. Let's let's juice this up. We'll do that. I do want to reroll. Uh, I'll take that one. And now projectiles and damage is what I'm going for now. Ooh, that could be a good one. I, I, I need projectiles and damage. Yeah, there we go. And we'll get you. Okay. Ooh, they changed the look on this one for uh, this guy. That looks pretty sweet. What about this one? Ooh. Blue lightning? That could be sick, dude. Oh, yeah. This looks a little better with the amount of ads we have going on. Looks pretty good. Okay. Another chest. I'd like uh, cooldown, maybe? <clears throat> Ooh. Attack speed's pretty good. Okay. Come on. There you go. Jeez Louise, man. Alright, I'll take damage. Let's run over... You know what? Let's run down this way. This is so something like right here. Might as well. Might as well. Uh, what is that? Burn damage. Okay, I mean... I mean, I guess that kind of works with what we're doing right now because we have the uh, the burning path from the uh, the hammer. So yeah, I can see that. I can see that potentially working. <clears throat> Paralyzing. I don't know about this, but uh, I'll I'll take it. I'll take it and run. We'll see what we got going on here. Um. Boom. And then I want projectiles and damage. Need projectiles and. Damage. Okay, we're not getting it. That's fine. <clears throat> Projectiles and damage is like the, the big one that we absolutely need right now. Because that'll help us out. I mean, at the moment, probably not a whole lot. But in the long run, that'll definitely be uh, super useful. Especially once we start getting the, the three, the three dead, the, um, the shockwave or whatever. That'll be super good. Okay. Run over here to this guy. Uh, I mean, this is okay. I don't know if it's anything super, super crazy, but it should be interesting, to say the least. Um, come on. There you go. 
There you go. Like, of course I want all the seedlings I can potentially get. But we're, we're slowly getting there. I mean, we're up to 15. More burn damage. I mean, I guess burn damage kind of helps a little bit, but nothing, nothing too crazy. Maybe we can go, like, a full-on burn build or something. I mean, we could take the, uh... Like, we have the burning path. We could take the burning uh, boots as well, but that I wasn't a huge fan of. Like, it just... It just felt super slow. But what we could do is take area on that and maybe uh, projectile speed it. Because I think that's considered a projectile, I would assume. The fire that goes underneath the boots. If you guys haven't seen that episode, make sure you guys go watch it back. I don't remember what episode it was. I'm, I'm sure it's like it was like 40-something, but I have no idea, to be completely honest with you. It's been a while. It's been a while. So we'll see we'll see how this this uh this goes. Um still hunting for that damage in projectiles over here. Perfect, there it is, and of course we don't have enough. So I'll throw a point into you, point into you, and yeah, we'll get this show on the road. <clears throat> I, like I said, I'm not I'm not too worried about the runs now. Um especially now that we're about to make it to the second ascension. Like I'm i I'm not really worried about this one either, because we should most definitely get the second ascension crystal will which will just make us that much stronger which means we'll just it'll just be a a walk in the park to say the least so but so far so good can't can't complain with what we got going on which is which is i'd say i'd say pretty good i mean we're getting loads of xp which is always nice um of course the more seedlings and gold right now would be nice i mean we actually got a quite a bit of gold i feel like like yeah we're only at 44 we're not gonna break we're not going to get up to 99 or anything, but we are getting pretty dang, like, we're getting a ton of XP and we're getting pretty close to where, like, I think the next, the next wave after the boss will definitely have, be getting, um, enough, uh, gold to potentially max out. But we are getting a good chunk of seedlings here. There's a lot of those plants around, so we are making some decent progress there. Um... I mean, we're only at 31, which isn't anything crazy. We'll probably end up around, like, 250, I would assume, when we finish. <clears throat> which, I feel like it's kind of expected. That's not too terrible, but not not super great either. Not something where, I, like, I would absolutely want to be. But uh, something that we could definitely work with, I guess. Okay. Alright, let's see if we can get something good here. <clears throat> cool down? Yeah, I'll be cool down. I think almost anything that the boots give, or not the boots, the uh, hammer gives, because that's what we're trying to do is juice up the hammer. The damage though is definitely a little weak on the on the hammer, that's for sure. Duration, I don't want duration. Duration, I'll take the projectile though. And then seven to ten projectiles. We'll boost this up, this up, this up. Um. I'll take this for right now. Just because, like, yeah, we could take damage, but I think in the long run, we're not going to be taking... Like, right now, I could easily take the damage if I wanted to. <clears throat> but I just... I don't know. I like the, uh, the cool... I think it's cooldown and attack speed, right? Yeah, cooldown and attack speed. I think I'd rather have that instead. Like, don't get me wrong. I loved the damage the first few runs we did. Like, if we could get the potions and stuff. Which, I mean, yeah, I guess we do have the potions down now. But I'm a huge fan of uh, the bear now. Because, like, it procs, like, every 7 seconds or so. 11 seconds, which is pretty good. So, I do like that. We are up to 51 gold, which isn't too bad. Quite a bit of XP dropping. <clears throat> Here's this boss. We'll see how quickly we can wipe him out. Wipe it out. I don't know how quickly that's going to be, though. Okay. Especially if we can't, like, get right on top of it or whatever. Oh my gosh, I thought it would, like, we just killed it somehow, and it's like, how the heck is that even possible? Like, we weren't doing, like, no damage to it. Okay. Yeah, we're still not really doing a whole lot of damage. Okay. I think I'm just gonna go for cooldown... Maybe attack speed and area. Definitely area. Maybe damage as well. 
Oh, this does 1.5 damage. I gotta remember that. Okay. And we should be killing the boss here in a second. Come on. Go for the dang boss, man. It's not aiming for the boss here. It's almost dead. It hit the boss. <laughs> it's going for everything else but the boss. There we go. Jeez Louise. Holy smokes, man. That was something. I'll take this. I'm taking the ring. I'm taking the attack speed. Rolling. Taking the gold. Ooh. The projectile. Projectile speed. The mushroom. <clears throat> Mushroom's so good. Crit. One red harder or less. It's useless. Attack. One damage, but ten attack speed's pretty good for this. And we can't reroll. That's a bit of a bummer. Alright, well then I guess I'll just head on out. Uh, actually, we got 20 points. Let's let's spend them. Double them up. Throw this here. Yup. Get you. Get you. Uh, get you. Probably get this. Get this. Um, and then probably work our way toward the cooldown. This should make us insanely strong. Oh my gosh, dude. Look at that. We need cooldown now. If we can get cooldown, we will be unstoppable. To where we can have it going off, like, literally non-stop. Like, we won't have that, like, little uh, break time there in the middle. Which is, I think, going to be the plan. Because, like, if we don't have that little, like, <clears throat> that little bit of leeway there in the middle where it, like, takes that slight little break, if we can do it without that, we'll be, we'll be huge. We'll be huge. So we'll see. We will see. Alright. I mean, right now we're looking pretty dang good. Like, I don't think we're going to run into too much of an issue. But, of course, I still want to uh, not have that. A little bit of cooldown. I would love to just have it going off non-stop. Just to get that, like... Of course, this kind of gives off a little bit of a broken effect. But having that other one, like, would definitely, like, having it with no, no, like, break in between here would definitely give off the full-on broken effect, which is what I'm hunting for. Which is what I am hunting for. And, of course, more damage. Um, so we'll get this guy. Throw a point into this so we can work our way to the cooldown. I don't think I'm going to go with anything else, though. <clears throat> I think I'm going to go with what I have. We probably should work on getting more hearts as well when uh, we go back to the next shop. I think, but like, like I was saying, I think I'm only going to keep the hammers. I don't think I'm going to take the swords, and I don't think I'm going to take the axes. I just don't think I'm going to. I mean, we're going to have enough points to do so, so maybe we will. If we have like a ton of points left over. After we max everything else, then yeah, I'll I'll do it. But right now, I don't I don't plan to do it. Um, let's run up here because there is a chest, and we'll head down to the gold altar. Duration cooldown projectile. Let's do cooldown. Like I said, I want to get cool. I mean, another projectile would be awesome, but it's not going to matter much if we still have that little bit of uh, <clears throat> dead space in between where it, we're waiting on the cooldown. So cooldown is definitely the way to go. And also remember, we have the damage shrine on top of the dam or the movement speed shrine. Although I do like the ooh, this is a, this is one we haven't seen before. Critical attacks have a ten percent chance of burning enemies. Okay, I think I'm gonna take that. I haven't seen this one before. Add it to the glossary, baby. Yeah, add it to the glossary. Sweet, sweet. There's a lot going on here. I think we could definitely end up... I mean, yeah, we're halfway through. But I think we could definitely end up getting, like, a good amount of gold this run. 
like a good amount of gold. Like we're already up back up to 12. Okay, I'll pick up some gold here. 18. There's another five. All right, we'll run down this way. We also have to make our way back up to the mine because I'm sure the mine is probably close to max by now would be my guess. Okay. Not looking too bad. Yeah, it's just it's just wiping everything out, man. All right, sweet. So yeah, we're gonna make our way up here. Uh, oh, only up to eight. That's okay. We'll get more seedlings. See, though, we're already up to 163 seedlings. That is way more than we had in the last uh, the last wave. I mean, it makes sense because it's gonna keep climbing, but the last wave, I think we were only around like 40 or 50, and now this one we just like tripled the amount that we were getting. So that's actually pretty huge. But I definitely need more damage because it's gonna be it's it's gonna be slow killing killing bosses and stuff. Um, so definitely we're gonna need to increase that area. I'll go area. I'll go area. Why not? All right. I mean we're looking insanely good still. Like there's so much XP. Like this is insane. Okay, up to 39 gold. Not too bad, but not uh, definitely not great. I would like to definitely get out of here with a little bit more gold if possible. We are up to 30 points though, so we could probably spend some on uh, some upgrades there. Um, so we'll max out this. Max out this. And... Yeah, I'll do something like that, I guess. I'll do something like that, I guess. Okay. Damage, cooldown, cooldown. Projectiles, sure. I'll take another projectile, why the heck not? I mean, the fire damage is starting to do some work on the ground there, but... We're still going all in on hammer, baby. Duration, I mean, I guess, even though I'm not a huge fan of it. I guess I'll take it. I'd still like to get more gold. Because that'll just help us a lot more with the amount of... Like, perks we'll be able to pick up. I mean, we're definitely covering, like, the whole ground now, which is ideal. Kind of what I was hunting for. Now it's just cool down to where we can just get it shooting out like repetitively. I mean, this guy we're gonna probably shred pretty quick because like he locks us in a box, so it's like he's not gonna really have too much of choice. I guess not necessarily shred him, but like we will end up killing him like I feel like fairly quickly in a way. All right, so I'll take that. Okay, we're already back up to like another 30 points. Jeez Louise, man. Oh, so it hit me and it immediately stopped. Is that what it's going to do? Okay. How does it go if I'm right next to him? Okay, well, he just died. <clears throat> Defeat Warlock or Glow in Expert Mode. Too easy, dude. Too flippin' easy. Take you, take you. Take this. Um, probably should get another full red heart, just to be on the safe side. I'll definitely take both of these. I'll roll once. Um, I really like the area. Um, I mean, rolling, we probably won't be able to get much out of it, but you know what? Screw it. Let's take this rare chest instead. <clears throat> Hopefully it gives us something good. Cool down. I'll take it. I'll take cool down. Any day of the week. We're already up to 254 seeds? Holy smokes, dude. How the heck did we get up there? We were just at 160, man. What the flip, dude? That actually is insane. So 260 is where we're is where we're looking right now. 260. And that is at the start of this run. Uh, wipe this guy out. There you go.
There's still a little bit of like cooldown. Not a fan of, but that's all right. Oh my gosh, we are blowing it through this with kills. Holy smokes, dude! We've already blown through 200 kills with like no problem at all. Uh, area probably should have went cool down, cool down. You gotta remember we we do have Talkor um, that we can see afterwards. So I'm not too worried there. Um, because we'll be able to pick up some more cooldown area damage, heart. Maybe not necessarily hearts, but more cooldown damage and whatnot. So, be able to do that. This will be good. Be very, very good for us. I mean, we are covering up the whole little map, which is huge. All right. I'm running down through here. Eight gold again, okay. So it's like probably like a half a wave. Maybe three three quarters of a wave to get full a full mine right now to get it up to twelve. Okay. Let's see what do we got here? We're up to forty-two points. Cooldown all I'll take. Okay, you're done. You're done! There's five gold up here. Which will put us up to at least 23. Okay. Holy gold right here. Okay. That was a lot of gold I was not expecting. I guess I'm never really expecting it. It just drops. Pick you up. Okay, we're up to 65 points. This is actually freaking insane. Um, I guess I'll boost max movement speed. I guess I'll boost this up too. Okay, I'll do damage. Fire damage. Uh, what is this sitting at? Sure. Guess I'll do boots because I already have them. Why not? We'll see about getting the other ones. Holy smokes, this is crazy. Axes actually could be wild. I think I'm gonna pick up Stormbringer next. Cause that could be insane. With, especially with how many projectiles we have. Stormbringer could be gnarly. Okay. This is looking pretty good. Cool down, cool down, cool down. Damage? Okay, I'll take damage. We definitely need damage. That's something that we're definitely lacking on right now, is definitely damage. For the uh, for the hammers, at least. We definitely didn't focus on that as much. I'll take another projectile. Why not? Why the heck not? I mean, and getting all this XP will help with getting, uh... Hopefully maxing out Stormbringer. That'll be huge. Okay, I'll grab you. I'll run up here, I'll pick these two up, and then I'm gonna run directly straight for the damage shrine. Okay. There we are. Ooh, that actually hit me. Uh, cooldown. Okay. Pop this. I'm, my guess is it'll put us up to like 30, 40. Projectile speed, projectile speed. I'm totally taking both of those. We're at 403 seedlings. That is massive. Attack speed. Uh, damage. Projectile speed. Um. 
Um, attack speed. I guess I'll take duration and crit. Okay, and let's juice this guy up here. Um, sure, why not? Watch it be like one short or something on this one now. Oh, we were able to max it. Okay, cool. Interesting. So I'll do something like that then. Let's get this. Uh, let's get this show on the road. Let's see how quickly we can beat them with what we got going on here. Oh, we got one point left. So let's. Um, we got fifty thousand kills. That's actually pretty good. So let's throw it into here. So now we have all of our points spent, and let's see where we end up. Oh yeah, see, this is what I was talking about with how many, um, how much we were throwing. The problem is. We could easily die if we get hit by this stuff. Oh, like we got hit by the axe again. We're not killing them very quickly is the problem. And with what we got going on, we have to kind of be close to them in a way. Okay, they're almost dead. Come on. Okay, we killed him. Oh, we killed them both. Whew. What? What the heck? What? Syndroc? What the heck is this? I was not expecting this. Crap, we should have went for more hearts. We're going to end up dying here. We should have went for the extra life. Crap. Come on. Come on. No. Oh my god, they came back. Oh my god, dude. This is our first loss in a long time. I was not expecting that at all. What the heck? Alright, let's... Oh my god, dude. Okay, so that freaking sucks. Um... What is this? Plus one revive? We are totally taking the plus one revive. I don't care. We, we are taking the plus one revive. Um. Getting more gold. Yup. Alright. Cool. Well, hopefully in the next episode we'll run Axeldor again, but we'll run, uh, I don't know, maybe swords or something. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Uh, I can't believe that just happened. I was not expecting that boss. But, uh, yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed Make sure you guys type that like button down below. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.